now. Give me just a half a second. Let me get the hot dog. Okay? Come on. Yeah. Mm -mm. Okay. Here we go. My word. Look at how many. You can tell winter's coming. It's like Game of Thrones. Ah! water bucket get over here by me. Hey everybody, happy Thursday. Um, running late again. That's going to be the norm until uh, Jim gets home. So, A lot of hungry babies here tonight. Hey. Not fight over food. Can't get it out quick enough, can we? Say no. You gonna fall you gonna fall off the other one did the other night. hard to get past everybody getting it. Here, I'm coming with him. There. Hey. Uh-uh. Be nice. There. Everybody. Uh, be careful. There we go. Under control now, maybe. Poor Foxy. It's going fast. We're gonna have to start getting more hot dogs. We're up to 10 pounds a night now because everybody's coming um, for the hot dog course, and uh, we were at eight. Well, during um, 
mama season, when the mamas were pregnant and they were first starting to nurse, uh, we were giving the moms and anybody that was here, basically, we were divvying out close to 15 pounds tonight. And then over after the baby started coming up and the mamas and everybody started going out and foraging and the babies were foraging, we went got all the way down to eight because we didn't want to waste. And then... Um, now it's, hang on buddy, um, oh goodness, I think you found one, what you doing baby, there you go, here, here, hang on. from the hospital. Jim is doing um, good. He was smiling uh, when I left. We were actually cracking jokes with each other. Um, and um, he's getting, they're, um, they're doing a process of elimination um, for the belly. So, um, hopefully, He'll get to come home soon. Just please keep up the prayers and uh, the support. I really do appreciate it. Come on, Woody. There you go, baby. And he really appreciates it. Um. You know, we don't have a whole lot to share because we don't know anything yet. Um, just the process of elimination. So. I'm going to go get you all some marshmallows too, okay buddies? Alright. most of the day um, I went up there mid-morning um, and then um, yeah we spent most of the day together so. we got some good people uh, nurses and doctors. Um, they seem to know what they're doing, which is wonderful. They're very informative and um, these uh, 
Actually, the doctors are sitting and the nurses are talking in shock with me. So, and I talk it right back to them, so we're all pretty good with each other. He, he asked me every time, uh, I, the next day, he says, how many were there tonight? And I said, last night I said there was 29 for the dinner and then there was 26 for the the quick bed lunch right after dinner or supper. Um, I said three evidently decided to leave. So, so I'm going to do a head count right now. Okay. Scooter, I'm going to count you. I got Scooter over here in the corner with me. Um... So, scooter's one. It's one down at the bottom of the steps. Okay, two on the steps. So, that's three, four. Okay, we got five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, one. Three, two, three, two, three, four, three, five, six, six, three, seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty, one, thirty-two. And I don't see anyone on the ground. So, we got thirty-two here tonight. Um... Hi, baby. And y'all sure are eating all night. My goodness. Yes, you are. You sure did eat a lot tonight. Y'all want more cookies? How about I give y'all more cookies? I know Don gave y'all some food for the call day. And he told me he was going to give you food and he gave y'all fresh water. weekend off um, and just spend time with Jim up at the hospital and if he comes home this weekend uh, spend time with him uh, here and where we can both rest and uh, just get to spend some quality time without me running around um, doing my mini chores and uh, things I need to do uh, around the house and for the channel and other stuff that we've got going on. So, uh, he told me to take some time off if I wanted to. So, I'm thinking about it. I haven't made a definite decision yet. So, um, but if you don't see a post on Friday night, uh, don't get in a panic because the raccoons will be fed um, either by myself or by Dawn and Laura. So, yeah. What is it? What do you see out in the woods? Huh? What is it, baby? Well, Now everybody's eating, except for Bootsy. Bootsy, you gonna play with my laces? Hmm? Did you get enough to eat? I'm gonna go get you some dry food, okay? I'll be right back.
this. I'm gonna get you some more here in just a second, guys. Herbie, you gotta get off the table for me to feed you, honey. This is a message for Dawn. First of all, thank you for coming over and giving them dry food and giving them uh, fresh water. I really do appreciate it. And Jim appreciates it. And then... I also told Jim what you said about all the CAT scans. That after the current... <laughs> After the third cat scan, you'd think that when they didn't find the cat, that they'd give up. And he just started laughing. Oh, he he was he was giggling, and uh, he thought that was funny. So, thank you for passing that along. It really did make him giggle. Does everybody have what they need out here? Yeah? Alright, so who's going to be my thumbnail tonight? Hmm? Who's going to be the thumbnail on the video? Is the crew at the picnic table going to get it? What are y'all doing? See? Oh, well that was just precious right then. Everybody looking up. And then look at little Buttsy. Here, I can move this so y'all have more room. There you go. That better? Everybody got room to eat now? There's food over here. Yeah. Oh, and I need to get the bird feeders in. It looks like y'all clean those out, too. And you know what? I think I'll just, I'm not even going to fight trying to get over there with you guys. I'll just get them in the morning and fill them up when I come out to do the buckets. Yeah. Right? Yeah. I'm going to get this video loaded and I am going to bed. I'm locked. It's been a long three months. Yeah. Hi, baby. How you doing, magic man? Hmm? So somebody was asking, um, I was reading the uh, channel comments on YouTube last night um, about magic. They were asking about magic and when did he come back? If I'm not mistaken, he came back around 10 days ago. Um, he and Nellie showed up along with Chewy and Simon um, and Peaches. It was a whole bunch of them showed up for bed lunch. And it was like, oh good. You know, there's nothing wrong with them. It was just, um, it was right after the, the coyotes were running up and down the road and... And all that stuff, so magic's good. Eat me. Say so yes, he is. Who is that? Is that you, Charlotte? I hear you. I'm trying to get my attention. Do you see Charlotte? 
Mm -hmm. Do y'all see Charlotte? What y'all doing? Two on the table. And then one, two, three, four, five around the table. Goodness. Y'all are buddies, aren't you? Y'all all grew up together up here. I wonder what y'all, do y'all do stuff together out in the woods? Wouldn't that be interesting to be able to follow one of them? I know we could get trail cams, but, oh my gosh. This is a full-time job within itself. I remember when Jim and I first started seeing each other. He told me this was a full-time job, and I was like, Really? How can this be a full-time job? You go get the food and you feed them. Oh. Oh, was I wrong. Before we got married, I learned that really quick. And with 42 that are not here all the time, so that's the max that we've counted this year. I think it was 42. Maybe more. Um, my goodness, look at all these raccoons. Um, it, it's, they keep you busy. That's for sure. Look at all of them. Aren't they sweet? Yeah. Listen to them crunching. That's Lucy over there. I see you, Lucy. Yep. What are y'all doing? Huh? Well, I'm going to head in. I see you, buddy. Bye, Peaches. I see you, too. Okay? Y'all take care. I'll see, you I'll see you tomorrow night, probably. Maybe. We'll see. If I get home late, we'll see. Okay? Well, everybody, thank you again for all your support. We definitely appreciate it, and thank you for the prayers. Oh, my gosh. Yes, definitely. Um... We really do appreciate those. And Bishop Kulik, uh, Jim has his cell phone on him. If you want to give him a call, um, it's off right now, but if you want to give him a call tomorrow morning, um, I'm sure he would love to hear from you. If you haven't already talked to him today, I don't know if you have or not. So, let's see if I can find the little fur balls. There's Charlotte. I don't know where he is. Are you in the house? No. He's not on the bed either. Connor, are you in here? There he is. Look at it. Hi, buddy. Hello. Say, so this is where I lay when I lay with my dad on the couch. Yeah. You miss your daddy, don't you? He said something about him tonight. He says, oh, he's going to be mad at me again. And I said, oh, it'll only be for like 30 minutes. He, that's what he did last time. He ignored Jim for like 30 minutes to an hour. And then he become his friend really quick. Hey, Charlotte. Look at here. What you doing? Hmm? Hey, Charlotte. Charlotte, come here. Come here. Let me try to see what she does. Come on. Watch. Come here, baby girl. Come on. Come on up with mommy. Come on. There we go. It's a good girl. She's a sweet cat. Nobody can pick her up. But she sure is a little love bug. That's for sure. Aren't you? Yes. She's got fur that feels like a rabbit. It is so soft. It really is soft. Yeah, she's a good baby. 
Yes, she's a good girl. Well, again, I'm going to say it again. Good night, everybody, and thank you, and thank you for all your support. And we'll talk to you soon. Thanks. Bye-bye.